Hello developers, welcome back to Before I Live and this is an awful stack of and videos application development tutorial series and we are very much uh, at the end of the series now let's go ahead and try to do something cool now so in my previous video I showed you how you can use Laravel on the Kinwin and also showed you the search component and we had a bug in the search component which we will be solving today okay let's go ahead and try to solve some cool features and if you have a um, question regarding any of our tutorials, go ahead in our Facebook group and you can comment your available feedback. Okay? Thank you. Uh, now let's go ahead and uh, do the presentations for our blog and you will understand there is, there is something we, we need to take care about. So let's do the presentation from here. And since I will mostly return this page and I don't need the tag so I can simply remove this tag from here. And instead of care, I will do the presentation by one and let's do these things. Now you see uh, I have the presentation that I returned by Laravel, but I have one more problem here. If you let's see click carefully that after the search my string is missing. So if I go to the page two, if I go to the page two, I will not have the uh, biggest string up there. So that is a problem, okay? So now I will show you how you can add that string automatically from your controller. So let's go ahead and try to do this. Let's see if it works. Append. And then we will append the request start all. So I have all the input actually. So let's see if it works now. Uh, okay, sorry. It is. Uh, it will not work this way. So what I will do is, I will actually um, write it the other way around, so it is not the way to write, so I will copy that part, remove that, and then I can say, okay, return blog appends request.org. Perfect, right? So it should get uh, it should add the string. Perfect. So you see now I have search string page space. So it will be it will add all the available strings. So let's say if I do to the end s equal blah blah blah. Let's add more equal. So it will add all the query string. Okay, uh, it will append. So I hope you understand now how you t how to do that. Now let's go ahead and return an actual blade file, and let's do this way. So let's save it inside the same variable and update it. Okay, now we can return the blocks. Okay, should be really fine now. Perfect, awesome, it works. Now let's move on and solve this search uh, search problem. So. Uh, there is a documentation in uh, in Vijay's documentation. You can find um, even even handlers, and inside the even handlers, you will have quite a lot of uh, event things like stop and passive and other uh, important propagations. So you can uh, stop the propagation of a click event. So what you can do is just you can go ahead and. Um, do the click dot stop so it will stop uh, propagation so we will do in the second one uh, fake stopping so that at uh, so that it will not run anymore so click dot stop so this uh, clicking will not be uh, executing in this uh, in this part anymore so it's just stopping so now let's check it out and if it works or not perfect so I'm clicking on this area and I'm able to write it and it doesn't uh, disappear now it will only disappear when you click in the auto div so that's working now let's go ahead and try to um, pass the string and refresh the page so let's say I have a string here and here instead of name since we are not using it should be type text and or search I don't know maybe then you can go ahead and try the model equal search uh, sorry the model should be string in here based on a click so you can say uh, at click 
I can take you window dot I'm not sure if it is how you write it uh, let's run a method instead much more cleaner um, show search block so what I can do is I can go ahead console.log this dot string let's check it out now this is yep this is so it works all works super fine so what I can do is window dot location and just let's check if it works So it takes me to the local page, okay? So that's working really nice. So let's use ES Extreme Literal and we will move on. You, you have to add the slash to get the base URL. So we will do search and string equal the variable this dot string. Super fine, right? So we will go to that page now. Perfect. Do this, and it comes to this page, right? Awesome. So it's really fine. And let's see if we can add something or add on enter. We can do the search log method as well. We can do a lot of cool stuff. As much as you want. Uh, maybe at enter. Um, I have forgotten it, but you know what I wanted to do. So hope that works. So you can say view enter even handling okay so that's really uh, simple I think I forgot it we on we will uh, save and dot target but let's check it out okay odd key up dot enter okay uh, okay I think I messed it up with IVUI so on IVUI you write just on key up at on enter that works there but it, sh it doesn't work with a normal input box so I have to use a default way of input box so let's go ahead and try this at keyup.inter let's check it out now view yep it works nice right so there is nothing with view and this search is not really good I can say because um, you know with the view it doesn't return anything so it's it's not uh, a perfect or good one so or we don't have any tag with this view it should have been like that but it's I my intention was to show you uh, how you can do that okay so thank you guys for watching in the next video I will go ahead and try to show you how to do the uh, login and registrations and hopefully comment system as well thank you have a nice time take care